Hello and welcome back to this channel. Dear students, this topic is LM317 and LM337 voltage regulator. That means we will be studying adjustable positive voltage regulator and adjustable negative voltage regulator. As the name indicates, these are adjustable voltage regulators. That means output voltage can be adjusted within certain range. Now first part adjustable positive voltage regulator that is LM317. Exam point of view say, hum log aise question expect kar sakte ki mm, draw the block diagram and explain its functioning for adjustable positive voltage regulator or for LM317 voltage regulator. This is the block diagram of LM317 voltage regulator. As the name indicates, it is adjustable means voltage, output voltage can be adjusted and it is positive voltage regulator. So output voltage is positive. This is basically a series voltage regulator. This is in the video in this unit ke pehle video mein explain kiya hai. So in place of single transistor, two transistors are used as a series pass element. This is called Darlington pair. So two transistor which forms Darlington pair acts as a series pass element. From this point, we are getting output. This output is fed back like this and it is applied as, as one input to the comparator. The another connection for the comparator is reference voltage, this connection. See, this output is one input to the comparator. Another input of the comparator is this reference voltage. So, uh, naturally, we need to provide certain reference voltage. This comparator will be continuously comparing the available output that is voltage at this point which is output voltage it continuously compares this available output voltage with the reference voltage and accordingly the regulatory action will be taken before i forget if you haven't yet watched the first video of unit number three please do watch that video because all the things every explanation is interlinked it is related to the uh, first unit i mean first video so depending on this uh, output voltage and reference voltage comparator generates the error signal or error voltage which is used to control this uh, Darlington pair that is series pass element. Now one more uh, register is shown in this diagram that is R limit register whenever the current exceeds than the specified value means due to some reasons suppose current bad jata hai circuit ka than the desired or specified value in that case this output voltage which is the voltage across this register is applied to the protection circuit and protection circuit will switch off this Darlington pair so the Darlington pair will be switched off whenever the current exceeds beyond a particular uh, value. So it provides the protection circuit. So this is the simplest explanation as far as this adjustable positive voltage regulator is concerned. We'll discuss uh, this in detail while solving the numericals related to this LM317. Now let us discuss few important specifications for this uh, positive voltage regulator rather adjustable positive voltage regulator LM317 from the exam point of view usually uh, the question may be like this draw and explain block diagram of uh, LM317 and state uh, specifications specifications or features so first feature is adjustable output voltage range means you can uh, adjust the output voltage right from 1.25 to 37 volt the output current is greater than 1.5 amperes. Third, short circuit current limiting pro uh, protection. This is inbuilt in case of LM317. Then it also has thermal overload protection. And last is output safe area compensation. Next part is derivation of output voltage for LM317. This is a three terminal IC. So three terminals are, this is input terminal where I have written VIN. This is output uh, terminal from where we are getting output voltage <coughs> and this terminal is for adjustment purpose. So this particular current is marked as IADJ that is I adjustment. Two resistors are used R1 and R2. R2 is a potentiometer that means it is a variable resistor. whereas resistor R1 is usually fixed 
this value is 240 ohm if these values are fixed i mean if r1 is 240 ohm then as i said this current passing through r1 is i1 so voltage drop across this resistor that is across r1 i will mark this as v reference so v reference is i1 into r1 and this value is typically 1.25 volt this value is fixed now this is a potentiometer or variable resistor so by changing the position i mean changing the value of this r2 we can adjust the output voltage v0 now i have written v reference is 1.25 volt do remember v reference is voltage drop across r1 that means voltage from this point up to this point now refer this diagram we can easily say output voltage that is v0 that means i am talking about this output voltage will be equals to i1 r1 that is voltage drop across this plus voltage drop across r2 current passing through r2 is denoted by i2 so output voltage will be voltage drop across r1 plus voltage drop across r2 recall the formula it's pretty simple voltage drop across resistor is current into resistor so i have written v0 is i1 into r1 that is voltage drop across r1 plus i2 into r2 that is voltage drop across r2 but we can write the equation of i2 that is this current this current is i2 refer the diagram ye i2 ke liye ye current aa raha hai i adjustment and this current is also flowing so i2 is basically combination or addition of i adjustment plus i1 ye dono current combine ho ke uh, they are flowing through r2 so that is i2 so i2 can be written as i1 plus i adjustment so this is the equation of i2 now let us put this value in the equation of v0 to v0 first term as it is i1 r1 plus ye jo i2 hai iske badle mein ye pura term put karna hai so it is i1 plus i adjustment into r2 what i did in place of i2 i have put i1 plus i adjustment now i1 into r1 is v reference so in place of this i1 r1 i will rewrite the equation like this in place of this i1 r1 i will write v reference because voltage drop across r1 is the reference voltage now this current is i1 so in place of this current i can write see we have this formula v reference is i1 into r1 so i can write i1 is equals to v reference upon r1 from this equation i1 is r1 sirf yahan pe transfer kiya so i1 is v reference upon r1 so in place of first term that is i1 r1 i have put v reference plus second term keep in mind ye i2 ke badle mein hum logo ne ye value put kiya i1 plus i adjustment into r2 as it is so in place of this i1 i am keeping the value v reference matlab this value upon r1 plus i adjustment into r2 now let us simplify this equation further it can be written as v reference plus v reference upon r1 into r2 plus matlab r2 se har ek term ko multiply karna hai plus i adjustment into r2 so this equation can be written as now we can take v reference common from first two terms so v reference is taken common ye common leke to pehle term ke badle mein 1 aayega 1 plus this v reference is taken out so it becomes r2 by r1 r2 by r1 plus i adjustment into r2 now what we discussed the typical value of v reference is 1.25 if we are uh, having this r1 equals to 240 ohm and this is a fixed value so this value is fixed this is a variable this term contains i adjustment into r2 so by changing the value of r2 we can change the output voltage v0 so final expression can be written as in place of v reference i will just put the value 1.25 in the bracket 1 plus r2 upon r1 plus i adjustment into r2 
usually this i adjustment this current is very very small uh, say it is uh, 100 microamperes or 50 microamperes so this term can be neglected so simplest formula of output voltage is 1.25 into 1 plus r2 upon r1 now let us discuss practical circuit see for practical application some extra components jaise is diagram mein dikha hai c1 c2 c0 ye extra components hai as well as D1 and D2, this diode is D2, D1 and D2 are again extra components uh, compared to the earlier diagram. So these are the extra components used for uh, practical uh, application. So this is the practical circuit for positive voltage regulator using LN317. Now in short, I have written the functioning of uh, each and every extra component which is connected in this diagram. This capacitor C1 is connected at the input side. ये कंसेप्ट याद रख लो इससे पहले अनरेगुलेटेड पावर सप्लाई है सो इफ द डिस्टेंस ऑफ दिस डायग्राम एंड अनरेगुलेटेड पावर सप्लाई इज मोर देन एंड देन ओनली दिस इनपुट कैपेसिटर इज रिक्वायर्ड द टिपिकल वैल्यू ऑफ दिस C1 इनपुट कैपेसिटर इज 0.1 माइक्रोफैरेड इट एक्ट्स एज अ फिल्टर एंड इट इज यूज्ड व्हेनेवर दिस रेगुलेटर सर्किटरी इज फार अवे फ्रॉम द प्री रेगुलेटर सर्किट then output capacitor C0 basically this capacitor is optional capacitor typical value is 1000 microfarad actually it is 10 uh, microfarad to 1000 microfarad it is used to improve the transient response then capacitor C2 I am talking about this capacitor which is connected from R1 uh, to the uh, bottom line so this capacitor is having typically uh, 10 microfarad value it improves re uh, ripple rejection capacity of the circuit then diode d1 and d2 are basically used for protecting uh, the circuit whenever there are low current points then capacitor may get discharged through the lo low current points to avoid this these diodes d1 and d2 are used so this is the practical circuit for adjustable positive voltage regulator Next part is adjustable negative voltage regulator. See, we have discussed the adjustable positive voltage regulator that was LM317. Now this is adjustable negative voltage regulator which is LM337. Dono ke operations, I mean everything is same apart from slight changes. This is negative voltage regulator earlier LM317 was positive voltage regulator. One major change as far as this block, internal block diagram is concerned. Pahle ke case mein, LM31 mein yaha se input dhethe tha, hamlogi spin ko input dhethe tha, aur yaha pe bhi adjustment lekha tha. That are, pins are interchanged. Ab dekho, operation is exactly same as that of uh, LM317. Another major change is, in case of LM317, the output voltage range is from 1.5 volt, 1.25 to uh, th plus 37. In this case, it is minus 1.25 to minus 37 volt. Now, as shown in this diagram, this output is fed back. Yahan se output le re, regulated output. This output is fed back to the negative terminal of comparator. This is operational amplifier which is acting as a comparator or it is also called error detector or error correction. So, it is applied to negative terminal. Positive terminal is connected to reference voltage. Hum logo ne already ye discuss ke LM317 ke case mein operation remains same this comparator will compare output voltage uh, with the reference voltage accordingly difference that is called error signal is generated and this error signal is used to regulate the output voltage yaha pe darlington pair dikha hai two transistors are shown again the functioning is same like lm317 ye r limit resistor hai so if the current exceeds beyond the uh, maximum limited value then in that case uh, the output is given to the protection circuit and this protection circuit will switch off this Darlington pair. So it avoids any further damage. So this is about the block diagram or functioning of adjustable negative voltage regulator. Now specifications of uh, LM337. Dekho, ye specification same hai that what we discussed for uh, LM317. Sirp ek specification change yoga. That is range of output voltage is minus 1.25 volt to minus 37 volt. But this sub specification as it is a diagram, I mean connection diagram is almost same as that of earlier case. 
ओनली डिफरेंस इज ये जो आई एडजस्टमेंट है ये यहां सेंटर पे कनेक्ट किया है बिटवीन आर वन एंड आर टू अगेन वी नो दैट आर वन इज यूज फॉर रेफरेंस पर्पज तो यहां से जो वोल्टेज ड्रॉप आ रहा है वोल्टेज ड्रॉप अक्रॉस आर वन विल प्रोड्यूस रेफरेंस वोल्टेज टिपिकल वैल्यू ऑफ रेफरेंस वोल्टेज इज माइनस वन पॉइंट ट्वेंटी फाइव होल्ड इफ वी कनेक्ट आर वन इक्वल्स टू टू फोर्टी ओ होम विच इज सिमिलर टू दैट ऑफ एल एम थ्री वन सेवन देन डेरिवेशन ऑफ आउटपुट वोल्टेज इट इज अगेन सेम एक्सैक्टली सेम एज दैट ऑफ एल एम थ्री वन सेवन ओनली द डिफरेंस इज यहां पर माइनस सेन आएगा बिकॉज दिस इज निगेटिव एडजस्टेबल निगेटिव वोल्टेज रेग्युलेटर सो माइनस वन पॉइंट ट्वेंटी फाइव दैट इज माइनस वी रेफरेंस इन इन द ब्रैकेट वन प्लस आर टू बाय आर वन अगेन दिस वेरिएबल रजिस्टर आर टू इज यूज टू मेक द एडजस्टमेंट आई मीन टू एडजस्ट द आउटपुट वोल्टेज वी जीरो दिस कैपेसिटर सी वन इज कनेक्टेड एट द इनपुट साइड विच इज कनेक्टेड फॉर द फिल्टरिंग पर्पज अगेन सेम लॉजिक इफ डिस्टेंस बिटवीन अनरेग्युलेटेड सप्लाई एंड दिस कनेक्शन इज फॉर देन देन एंड देन ओनली this c1 capacitor is used that means whenever this uh, connection this circuit is far away from unregulated power supply yahan pe v in jahan pe likha hai this is the voltage from unregulated power supply which is negative voltage v0 is again regulated output but it is again negative voltage so jaise distance zyada hai tabhi ye capacitor c1 uh, will be used as a filtering this capacitor c3 is output capacitor which is used basically to get more stability so remaining all the things are same as that of lm317 uh, so dear students that's it for today's session so thank you thanks a lot for watching this video